Hello everyone, so in this video let us talk about the first problem from the latest kickstart round from Google, round C. The problem name is new password. So you are given that a company named Godi has issued a new policy that the employees has to have a password which follows these five conditions. The conditions are that, that the length of the password should be at least seven characters, at least one uppercase, one lowercase, one digit and one special character should be that, there inside the password. Now there's an employee inside the password and all employees have to change that. Now Charles is an employee of that company and he likes his old password. So what if that he wants to change this old password to a new password, what all extra letters he want to append in your old password to get the new password. You just have to find out the smallest length of a new password that satisfy these conditions and that is somewhat uh, like only a concatenations of the characters from the old password only. So let us take the examples part. So what I have given here is that you are given an old password. So as you can see that this password of seven length only has digits. So uh, you have to now somewhat attach a, a lowercase, uppercase and a special character. So this is one of the valid part. And similarly for this, there is only one length that is one length character that is A. So in that you have to small and up, smaller case, a digit and, and a special character. So those are appended. And then because the length should be also seven, so you have to add extra whatever characters you want such that the total length now becomes seven. So these are the following uh, things you have to do. It's not too difficult to understand as well. So what you have to do is that you just have to count out a number of special characters, smaller, lower and digits inside the old password you have. Okay. In that password, then you just have to check that. Okay. I want at least one small, one large, one capital character one digit and one special character if all of them are present then it is fine if it is not present you just add one one type of the uh, let's say character you want and then if the length is smaller than seven you just append any random character uh, in the whole string such that its length becomes seven and that's the overall logic here nothing much too complicated i'll directly move on to the code part so if you have any doubts you can mention down in the comment box of this problem so what you can at least see is that we have taken the string length and then from the string length, you have four things, small capital nums and special characters. So you just iterate over this whole string and just check that. Okay. Whether the ith character is, is a small character, just increment the total count of small, then capital characters we have the num numbers we have and the special character. So after iterating over the old password, you have the count of all the different type of uh, characters you want or it's it have. Now you want at least one small character. So whatever string you have, you just check that. Okay. These are the number of small capital nums and special type of characters we have. So in the end, if the number of small characters is equal to zero, which means that I do not have any small characters in the string then I want actually at least one. So I just append or like just pushed a small a inside the original password we have like the old password just append an a so that now the original password, like the new password have a small character. So if the original password, like the old password has no capital character, just append a capital character. If it has no numbers, append a like number. If I had no special characters, append like one, any one of the special characters that is, let's say hash. So I append, uh, this is a hash. So I append hash. Okay. And now all the four characters are like all the four, uh, uh, like the definitions are satisfied. There's also one more definition that the first one, it has at least seven characters. So you can just do a while loop. It's very small. So till the size is less than seven, if it's less than seven, you can just keep on appending more A's inside it. You can append anything, but then just appending more A's until its size become greater than or equal to seven. If it's greater than seven, then, then this will not like this while loop will not start. If, if it's less than seven, it will keep on appending A's until its length become equal to seven and just like stop and just print out the answer. That's the overall logic for the first problem. Let us now move down to the second problem. So if you have any doubts, you can mention on the coin box. Thank you for watching this video. Till the end. I will see you next one. I'll like coding and bye.